I can be creator ambassador for the UK and I just wanted to go through with you very quickly the grouping feature in Canva. So I have got this template up that I've created and I want to group together a bunch of the text so I can move it all in one go. And to do that, I just have to drag the mouse across all of the information and I can now move the information within the design. It's all grouped together. If I come off of it, it will still be individual. So if I want it to stay grouped, I go over to the group option, click group, and it will put the information into one and it will stay like that until I ungroup it. Now, the good thing about doing this is if I wanted to in decrease the size of this information, but I wanted to do it all together and I wanted it to stay in this format, I can group the text and I can do that. So I've grouped it, I will select it and the little white dots come up in the corner. So I can now decrease the information or increase the information, but they will stay in the same order. And this is why I really like the grouping and resizing feature. Now it also works with elements. So for example, let's add a few um, fl flower elements into our design. So if I add one, two, say three, four, five, these are just random ones that I've added in, okay? I can now highlight all of them. Some of them were smaller than the others. And I can now decrease or increase the size of all of the elements in one go. So I can add the whole lot here. I've not unclicked off yet, so I can still move them. Once I unclick off, they all become separate elements again. That one's white, let's get rid of that one. Again, I can highlight all of them and I can move or decrease and increase them all in one go. So this is just a couple of quick features that are very useful. So the grouping feature, I can ungroup and they are now all individual boxes again, or I can highlight the lot and group and now they will stay together. Or I can just highlight them, move them, decrease them, increase them, click off, and they are then individual elements. And you can do that with both text and images and elements. Anything that you add to your design, you can do that. So that, again, is just a quick overview of the grouping and resizing feature in Canva.